A blessed morning, one and all. This is your apostle, Elijah Peter Chambers, once more with a pounding word. Hallelujah! A harsh one, and also an intriguing one. And our topic this morning, my story put behind bars for speaking, thus say the Lord. And this is our 93rd series and our theme, born to win. I heard that many of the hypocrites and ministers were upset of a prophecy given by a foreigner pertaining to God's agenda for my life and Jamaica. Hallelujah. It is sad that God pass all of you who presume yourself righteous and called and came and picked Peter Chambers selectively. You should be upset. Hallelujah. I heard some of you barking, you belching. The Bible says many are called, but few are chosen. And our scripture text is from Ezekiel chapter 8, verses 17. Then he said unto me, as thou seen, seen this, O son of man, O son of man, hallelujah, is it a light thing to the house of Judah that they commit the abomination which they commit here? For they have filled the land with violence. They have filled the land with violence, murder, evil, corruption, nepotism, rape, human trafficking, my card drugs, scamming, Uribaba Katadaba, hitmanship, the land, my card is corrupted with violence and have returned to provoke me to anger. Provoke, they are provoking God to anger. And lo, they put the branch to their nose. Therefore, we'll also deal in, in fury. God will deal with you in fury. My eyes shall not spear, neither will I have pity. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. And though they cry in my ears with, with a loud voice, yet will I not hear them. God will not hear you. My God Almighty, what a sad state Jamaica is heading to. I heard that some false scribes in, and Pharisees in Jamaica are upset about the prophecy God gave for Peter Chambers. God spoke to me that these prophet and prophetess God has passed by them because you are you are a part of the evil and corruption of this government you ate from the king's table hallelujah so God has passed by you he no more hallelujah will speak to you you will only feel the tickling anointing but just as God has rejected Samson because Samson stepped out of the will of God my presence have left you said God they will no more hear from God because they have supported the evil of this government. This will be revealed very soon. Hallelujah. Two celebration has just passed in Jamaica. Emancipation and independence as they celebrate from a false perspective while murder, corruption, nepotism, drugs, guns, rape, human trafficking, our young girls and boys are taken for human sacrifice. My God Almighty, what are you celebrating? 60 years of violence and murder. I am not celebrating because God is showing me that judgment is near and there will be no more no mercy because God has warned this nation and you have mocked jeer opposed his prophets the Lord spoke to me that the JCF will be exposed there will be another incident in the land of Jamaica that will cause a civil war then it will be proven that Peter Chambers was right and God has spoken hallelujah the Lord spoke to me 
Hallelujah. That Daniel Lee's bodies have not been found as yet. The leader of Jamaica has not said anything. He has been very quiet and silent. The question is, how did you send Sita? Hallelujah. With 50 men at Brownstone, Addison Park and drag me and place me in a prison without no evidence of their of your allegations hallelujah yet the murder with Donaldson Donaldson they are dancing and placing hip hop uh, hop scotch my God Almighty with the truth there are some JCF individuals coming on my profile attacking me on social media about the revelation God gave me you all need to go and fight God and not the messenger another disgrace will rock the JCF says God the international countries will see Jamaica as a territory of a death zone my God hear ye, the word of the Lord my God, there will be international investigation on the island when the international countries recognize the murder. The violence has taken over the land. The Lord spoke to me. He says, Peter, all the sectors that is within the capacity of the government is corrupt and evil. These few days, there will be more incidents to show and to prove that God has spoken. Peter Chambers is not the issue here. So don't get upset. God says, hallelujah, all their evil corruption will be exposed. Soon some will resign. Some will put guns to their head. You read the word of the Lord after the secret is being revealed they are the root cause why this island is in destruction some will fly out of this country because the damage they have brought to the island the lord reveals to me that there is two main organization hallelujah in this land who are connected to the human trafficking and of the missing girls and boys there will be such a disgrace and an exposure to the point that many will commit suicide the lord showed me in a vision that top rank police will commit suicide because all the all fingers will be point at him hallelujah hear me the word of the lord hallelujah you have turned this little island into your own kingdom and have brought gods my god almighty to the people have brought idolatry and evil and will be and all your evil and your idolatry will be exposed says god all eyes will be on jamaica because of the murder debt fear immorality corruption nepotism scamming and evil God will shake this little island and the earthquake will hit this island worse than Port Royal. Hallelujah! Thus said the Lord. The falls and political church will be exposed. And God said you will hear that many of them will experience death because they have connected themselves with the, with the government because of their belly. Hallelujah! Glory be to God. Your belly, you should be upset. Hallelujah. A woman, the Lord spoke to the woman. Hallelujah. And you are upset saying that, praise God, that why these foreigners giving prophecy. God cannot give you a prophecy because you're blind, deaf, and you're dumb, and you're corrupted with the king's meal. You're corrupted with the venom of Bill Gates. You're corrupted, my God, with Bill Gates' blood money. How oh, can you see? How oh, can you hear? How oh, can you talk when you have been bribed by the government? Rukatadaba. But God has spoken to me in 1999 that he's going to raise me up when the woman sent me the video and send it to social media. God 
brought me back my God Almighty to 1999 when he led me into the wilderness to fast for 40 days and he said Peter I will raise you in this country this woman is confirming the brother that gave the prophecy he's confirming thus say the Lord so don't get upset the very man that you said is false the very man that you said is corrupt and evil is the very man that God is gonna raise up he has chosen many are called but few are chosen yes you chose many out of the eyes of hypocrisy out of pride out of loftiness hallelujah but God said tell them all your ministries will be going down watch it COVID shut you down COVID show you so you don't have no power COVID show you that you are just pretending COVID showed you Makatadaba, that you were not a man of God, a woman of God. You are a so-called man of God, a prophet, a prophetess, a bishop. You weren't called. If COVID crippled your ministry, Rukatadaba, the question is, who is it that call you? Hallelujah. Jamaica is going down in the 60th year. Just say the Lord.